<laughs> okay, so the sternocleidomastoid, that's the big muscle in your neck right here. Um, on the back of the neck, there's the semispinalis capitis. That one goes straight up and down along the spine. And then the splenius capitis goes diagonally on top of that one. Um, uh-oh, wait, hold on one second. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. <laughs> These are his feet. <laughs> this is his head. <laughs> this is Rhiannon. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Okay, so the pectoralis minor, that's this one. Can you see how on this side of the model they've cut it away? So you've got the real superficial muscles over here, and these are the deeper ones. This is the pec minor. Um, serratus anterior is this one that looks sort of serrated, <laughs> like feathery on the side right there. Um, on the back is the trapezius. That's this really big diamond-shaped one that covers everything. It's very superficial. Um, the levator scapulae is this one right here. So their splenius capitis right in front of it is the levator scapulae. Uh, rhomboid Rhomboides major and rhomboides minor. These are these that are shaped kind of like little rhomboids or like little diagonal rectangles between the shoulder blades. This is um, the rhomboides major and the smaller one's the rhomboides minor. Now the pectoralis major, that's this one right on top of the pec minor. Um, latissimus dorsi. Right here. So it's right on the, the lower back and it goes up towards your arm here, so it's that one. The deltoid is the shoulder cap muscle. Um, of course it came off of this model, but it, it's a triangular one here and I'll show you better when I get another model. Um, on this model, you can see the supraspinatus, the infraspinatus, and the subscapularis. And if you remember those fossas from when you did the scapula, does anybody remember those vaguely? Remember the spine of the scapula? That's this right here. The supraspinatus is above the spine, so it's this muscle at the top. Infraspinatus below the spine, so it's this one below it. And then subscapularis is in the subscapular fossa on the front of the scapula. Okay. And that's it.